Hello, my friends. We're here in Korea today. I got my buddy Al with me, and we're going to talk i2, a brand new machine that we're stoked to talk more about and introduce you to as well, Al. I see a B-axis moving head. I see two spindles. We don't like to call them sub-spindles anymore. We like to call them spindle one and spindle two. But let's talk about this machine as I see Harmony behind you as well, which continues to excite me. Do you have an overview we can talk to the audience about? Yeah, quickly, um, the Harmony control is the newest control um, interface from uh, Washon. It is actually a fanning control in the background, but it's got their interface or user interface on the front end, and it really brings all of the uh, bells and whistles, so to speak, of a conversational style control um, and a user interface that, as we know, uh, we're trying to attract the younger crowd to our uh, business. And uh, this is the kind of stuff they grow up on. It's a Windows interface. And so um, they're gonna be very excited about it. And I'm very excited about what this is gonna bring to us overall. Um, as far as the machine is concerned, um, this is something we've been waiting for for quite some time. We haven't had a good B-axis machine. And uh, this is a very exciting product. You can see by the look of it, it's built very much as a typical wash on, overbuilt, heavy duty. Um, it's not a sub spindle machine because both spindles are exactly the same. Therefore, it's a twin spindle with a V-axis on it. And uh, we're, uh, again, very excited about where this is gonna bring us in the future. Yeah, I can only imagine. I wanna go back to that software real quick, Al, because you and I, I would think we're considered more of the old heads in our industry at this point. And sometimes us old heads don't like change, but we want something to be really user-friendly. You mentioned the youth. The youth are gonna adapt easily. Yep. It's built for them. They, they're in, they were born with stuff in their hands that we had to adapt to over time. So how user-friendly is it for everyone as we incorporate these more and more into the machine shops? Um, very. Um... If you use any kind of a Windows product, you'll be able to use this and you'll be excited about it. And I, I don't care who you are, if you're working in this trade, you've had to use some Windows products. So that part of it you'll adapt to nicely. But truly, if you want to use the FANUC side of it, there's simply one button that brings you back to the legacy FANUC side on it. And it'll program and run and look like any FANUC control you've ever been used to. But if you wish to go ahead and use the new style or the graphical interface that is part of the Harmony, you will find a host of very nice products in there and uh, everything from tool management to job management, um, programming, there's conversational programming in there. It, it's all in there and it's a very, very nice product. Yeah, we always say take it to you know the next level or turn it up to 11. I mean, this is the technology that we need to adapt ourselves to and learn quickly. The shops that are improving in technology are making more money as well. I want to talk a little bit about this technology as you and I are familiar with just the concept and idea of flexibility and adapting multiple operations into one machine. I was just talking to one of Washon's uh, big, big clients and they go, you know what? We've been doing something for 18 years the same way and we figured out how to do two Two operations in one machine, free up floor space and everything else that goes along with having to do more operations in the same machine. Yep. A machine like this helps so much with something like that, doesn't it? Yes, it's amazing. Um, the name of the game anymore is multitasking. Yes, and it is. Getting more done in a single setup and, and partly due to the labor shortage. Um, cost of labor is also astronomical. Anytime we can combine products or um, operations and create a uh, more streamlined um, process. In the end, the company that buys the machine wins. Uh, we all do this business in order to make money. That's what you're in business for. That's why you machine parts. In the end, it's all about can you make a profit. This makes it easier for you to make a profit. It's, it's again, there's, as you can see by the beef in this machine, you're not going to have to back off on rigidity or heavy cuts. At the same time, you're getting five axis capability. You're getting all your turning capability in it. And so, and it's at a price point that's very attractive. So we're very excited to bring this to the market. You know, Watch on does carry the beef, as Al just said, to make sure as they do have their own foundry vertically integrated from bottom to top to make sure that you're taken care of, to make sure it all matches from beginning to end. Talk to Productivity, talk to Al. If you wanna learn more about this machine and how these capabilities can support you and your factory, why not make more money? Why not have more harmony in your life? Thank you all for watching. Yeah. This is MTD CNC, Al. Always a pleasure, my friend. Thank you.